what could you do if it wasn't there anymore? You know, these are, to all those of us in the business, it's what we call activities of daily living, right? What activities would be better? Okay, we always say there's three levels of neuropathy, mild, mild, and severe. Mild means it's recent onset, and mild, it, does, it bothers you, but it's not, it's, it, you know, you live with it. Moderate is it's been there more than a year, starting to affect your activities of home and, and recreation and the fun things that we want to do, right? Then severe is more than a year, usually two years or more, and it's incapacitating. And these are the, baby, these are the patients who come in on crutches, uh, on, with canes, with walkers, in wheelchairs. It's tough. It's, it's tough to see. But wouldn't it be wonderful if we could change that? You know one of the biggest fears that our seniors have? How many of you work with seniors? Nobody? That's about all I do now is work with seniors. Their biggest fear is being put into a nursing home because they know that that is the waiting room to heaven, right? God's waiting room. They know it, and they know that if they go in, they'll probably never come out, and that's a problem. All right, I always say could, you could stop worrying about because it's not, it's not spoken. You know, it's whispered, you know. Mom's going to have to go into the nursing home. We're going to have to put Grandma in the nursing home. Why? Because she can't get around anymore. How many of you have been told that there's no help? There's nothing more to do. We can't fix neuropathy. You're going to have to learn to live with it. I hate it. Everybody hates it. You know, if we can send, it's old, if we can send a man to the moon or a, a, a probe to Mars now, if we can clone a sheep, which we've done, right? Why can't we get rid of neuropathy? Well, I want to tell you something. I got good news. You knew this was coming. The, there is a treatment, there is a cure, and there is relief available. The NeuroCare unit, the True Tesla NeuroCare, which is what we have here, a very, very simple device lightweight, easy to use, easy to use for doctors, easy to use for nurses, easy to use for the patients. Now, listen, when we first started treating neuropathy in our clinic, uh, we didn't have this unit. We had some big $45,000 e-stem units. And I want to tell you something, they worked pretty good. When we got this, wasn't but about three weeks and all of our patients we just used this on a few people because we didn't know we didn't know was it any good it looked little it didn't look powerful we had these big units that looked powerful but let me tell you something every single patient that we treated with this after the second treatment refused to have any other treatment because it was that effective uh, we have a, a lady here tonight, I think, do we still have her? She's still here? That's going to tell you about d what Dr. Harris told you about. You know, and, and we see this every day. We see it, and I'm on the phone every day with patients for the company, and we've sold thousands of these units throughout the country, and I can't tell you the number of patients that... Now, does everybody get well? Hello? Does everybody get well? No. Nothing's 100%, right? If I told you it was 100%, you wouldn't believe me anyway. And you'd think I was lying, and I would be. But let me tell you something. We have an extraordinarily high success rate. All right. It's a true Tesla muscle stimulant. It's the best kept secret in, the, in, the, in, the, in medicine. It's been around for actually for 20 years. But what's interesting is the guy that designed it, invented it, is kind of like a genius engineer. But he didn't know anything about marketing or sales. So... Uh, when we started working with it a couple of years ago, uh, Renew Medical, they started getting this thing out and start getting it out to doctors and clinics and, and patients, and it really started to catch on. So now that's what we're doing full time. Uh, it's the most powerful unit that's ever been produced. It's engineered and produced here in the USA, no foreign hands. What does it do? What does it do? It provides a gentle, painless, deep muscle contraction. This is important. The deep muscle contraction, think about squeezing a sponge, gets the blood going. 
What we're doing is by contracting the muscles, we're increasing the blood flow, the blood velocity, the blood speed, the amount of blood going into the area, in the case of a leg or a foot, right? If we increase the blood flow, what are we increasing? Blood, oxygen, vitamins, nutrition, red cells, white cells, yes? What does that do to the area? It causes it to heal, doesn't it? Now, how many of you are familiar with things like TENS units? Okay, for pain management, right? Pain management units simply short circuit the pain fibers. But this causes an increased circulation so that we can pump good stuff in, and when we pump good stuff in, what goes out? Bad stuff. All the inflammation, all the infection, all of the waste products and the byproducts of neuropathy or wounds. Okay, we're going to show you something here in just a minute. Um, we actually found out that it proliferates approximately 300 to 500 percent more oxygen, red and white blood cells and nutrition, which means more healing deeper into the dead and dying nerves and blood vessels than anything on the planet. And that's a bold statement. I stand behind it 100 percent. Our company stands behind it 100 percent. We've, we've, we've gone head to head with every expensive E-STEM unit in the country, and some from foreign countries, and we have beaten them hands down, including, by the way, hyperbaric chambers. Hyperbaric chambers, oxygen chambers that force oxygen into the tissue from the outside, yes, okay, but the problem is that there's already too much pressure in there. When we have a wound, oops, sorry, when we have a wound down here, when we have inflammation, edema, swelling, there's a lot of pressure in there. There's so much pressure in there that the regular pressure, blood pressure from the heart, which is already diminished by the time it gets down there anyway, can't get through the capillaries. The capillaries then collapse from the, from the interstitial pressure and don't work. By increasing the flow, by increasing the velocity, we overcome that. It's simple matter of physics, or biophysics, if you'd rather. Okay, so we got rid of all of that. It generates more healing. Now, remember we showed you some of these before with the black toes and the, the missing toes and the open sores. Two months later, same feet, what do you see? No sores, no open wood. Same feet, two months later, we did a study with 87 diabetic patients that were scheduled for amputation. 87. Out of the 87, we saved 80 feet. It's not 100%. Close. Ladies and gentlemen, there just isn't anything like this. I've been amazed. Everybody that sees it, everybody that uses it is amazed. How can something this wonderful, this powerful, well, somebody had to invent it sometime, right? Somebody had to figure it out sometime. We just happen to be the people. Um, this is what it looks like. It comes in a little handy carrying case. And if we can do it for that patient there, imagine what it can do for things that are already without sores. Right? Okay. Is it a tension? We talked about that. It's not. It doesn't mask the pain, but it causes a healing. It causes the body to heal itself. All it does is stimulate the blood flow. I mean, it's such a simple principle, it's, 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 it's silly. It's simply amazing. Now, a lot of people say to me, well, yeah, okay, but <laughs> what's the catch? Sounds too good to be true, right? Okay, well, how does it work? We talked about that. It forces out the edema, the swelling, and the infection, and generates more healing. But it does take time. Oh, you knew there was a catch somewhere. You thought that if we just w did one treatment, right, it would go away. Nothing goes away that fast. We talked about it a minute ago. That one foot that was so bad took two months to heal. That's phenomenal. You talk to any wound care specialist. Any, any wound care people in here? No? You talk to any of them. They'll tell you that that's remarkable, absolutely remarkable. But it does take time. Uh, it heals damaged nerves and capillaries. Nerves, by the way, only heal at the rate of, if you'll remember your guidance physiology or something thereof, 
uh, one millimeter per month. That's it. How am I doing on time? I'm good. So what do we do about the remaining pain in the meantime? Pain relieving medication. This is important for you to know. While the patient is healing with the NeuroCare True Tesla unit, we'll talk about True Tesla in a second, uh, we have to do something with the pain. So we actually do uh, injections of Marcaine into the three or four major nerves of the feet. For a diabetic, this is nothing because we use a needle roughly the same.